I am Anil Kumar and here is a challenge question on probability model test. You are given expectation equals to 3 and variance equals to 4. Find e of 2 minus 3x and variance for 2 minus 3x. So that is the transformed random distribution. Correct. So you can pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestions. Now in this particular case, we are given that the expected value is equals to 3 and the variance is equal to 4. Now how are these two related? We know variance is basically equals to mean of squares minus squares of mean, right? So kind of, if you recall that formula, right? So uh, in general, we could write this as uh, uh, let's say sigma or when you're doing continuous functions it could be integral it could be either one of them x square uh, probability or f of x you say f of x that is the mean of squares minus square of mean right so that is what it is mean and expected value is same right so in our case we are given variance of four and this particular thing is here is x square fx. We'll call this a constant and minus uh, uh, expected mean is 3. So it will be 3 square, correct? So if you reorganize, you get 4 plus 3 equals to this constant x square fx. Okay. So 4 plus 3 is 7. So 7 is this constant. So that is one equation which is going to help us to really solve this particular question. Now let's look into the question once again. It says we are given that the expected value for the random variable x is 3 and the variance is 4. Find the expected value for 2 minus 3x and variance for the same. Right? That is what it is. So the function has been transformed. Now, based on that, let's look into the transformation part first. So, what is E? 2 minus 3x equals 2. Right? So, this is what we need to calculate first. What is this equal to? Right? So, in our case, we can substitute the value 3 for x, correct? And find the value. So, it is equals to basically 2 minus 3 times 3 right 3 times 3 which is equals to 2 minus 9 or minus 7 so this value is minus 7 so that is how we could find this value now as far as the variance is concerned variance for 2 minus 3x will be equal to this quantity which is which we are calling as a constant minus the mean square right minus the mean square that should give us the variance now this quantity here is 7 right so we have uh, 7 minus the mean square which we have calculated as minus 7 so that is equal to minus 7 whole square right so that is how we could find it so it is equal to 7 minus 7 squared is 49 and always when you find the variance we it could be plus or minus but variance we take as a positive quantity right so we'll take absolute value of this so that is equal to 36 right so we get the answer as mean of minus 7 and variance of 36 right so that is how you could solve this question amanil kumar and i hope that helps thank you and all the best